وقضا ربو کا اللہ تعبد اللہ Your Lord has decided that only He would be praised. And your Lord has decided that parents must be treated in a best manner. Currently, in the world there are human rights, but the rights of an individuals are not defined in detail. For example, what is the right of the father? And what is the right of a mother? The Quran says, the reason the old age is emphasized on, the amount of patience is reduced in it. Young person can tolerate the toughest situation. It becomes very difficult to endure in the old age. People usually complain about the older people, that why do they get angry so quick? Trust me, when you will get old, you will also have a short temper. This is why we must take extra care of old people, because they are sensitive and short-tempered. So Allah says when your parents are old, do not even utter few to them. Do not ignore them. And lower down your shoulders in abasement, in front of them. And always pray for them. My Lord, have mercy upon them as they brought me up when I was small. There is no alternate of the love and care of the parents in this whole universe. There is no better example of the care and love other than the love and care of the parents. And the amazing fact is that even the parents forget about the sacrifices they make for their children. The thing which parents forget Allah does not forget. This is why Allah has commanded that they have a biggest right. Unfortunately, this right is being violated nowadays. Children have started to scream at their parents. They destroy the things. They start to ask for their inheritance in the life of their father. There is a saying that if a person loses pudency, there is no way to cure that person. If you have lost pudency, then do whatever you want. Sometimes after the death of the mother, the father tries to remarry. The children stop him out of the fear of losing inheritance, that it will go to their stepmother. They should be ashamed of themselves. Rather, they should say, O oh father, everything belongs to you. We do not own anything. You groomed us. That is more than enough. We do not need anything else. But if you will have pudency, then you will understand these things. Pudency and faith in the God, the one who trusts Allah, that the sustainer is Allah. He is the one who gives respect. That person lives a life with pride and pudency. And a shameless person who does not believe that Allah is the sustainer, that person keeps an eye on the inheritance of his father and the wealth of other people. Though a father should leave inheritance for the children, but there are some things which children needs to take care of. That on what base are you keeping an eye on the inheritance of the parents? May Allah, the Lord Almighty, guide us and help us to respect our parents. Amin.